always say good morning no matter what time of day it is. Welcome to a rainy day in Arkansas again. Um, we are on our way to this salt room place where you breathe in salt. I've never done it before but we'll see how it is. Um, like I was worried about last night my lesson did get canceled because it, it, we're just it's gonna rain all day and be bitterly cold. So I'm trying to set one up again for Wednesday morning early Wednesday morning um, before I have my dental work done and uh, she said she'll get back to me so we'll see how that goes but for today uh, going to that salt room and going to uh, CVS to hopefully get the EpiPens because when I tried to get them last week I think a week ago exactly um, they did not have any in stock and then um, going to Walmart to pick up a couple of things but yeah, that's the weather for today. Tomorrow's supposed to be much nicer. It's supposed to be 68 and sunny, so it should be a fun day at the barn besides having to build a boat to get there. Um, but yeah, I'll let you guys know how the salt room and stuff went later on today, and uh, hope you guys are having a good day as well. Guys, I thought I'd vlog while we are sitting at the drive through of CBS. Um, so we finished the salt room, and I can say that it was very relaxing. I The time went by really fast. Um, and, uh, yeah, I would definitely do it again. Um, yeah, I enjoyed it. And, uh, <clears throat> I can't say, I can't say for sure that I noticed, like, a, a, a difference in my breathing, but I definitely was, uh, clearing my throat a lot, so I can say that some stuff was coming out. Um, <clears throat> and, uh, yeah, I, th I think you guys, any of you guys that are watching this, I think you should go and try it once. Um, it was pretty cool, so... Now it's back to the rainy weather, um, but picking up the EpiPens and then heading to Walmart, and, uh, yeah, that's about all. <laughs> Don't have a whole lot of, of, of wisdom to share, but, um, yeah. Do, an, do a salt room. I just said that, so. <laughs> we'll see you guys in a little while. Okay, guys, so we just got home. I changed into some dry, warm clothes, and, uh, got some chicken noodle soup going in the microwave and now I'm doing something that may seem strange but it makes me happy I am I go it may seem strange why it makes me happy but I'll explain in a second getting rid of this because it expires in just a couple of days and putting a new one in my purse and these are good till April of 2020 so another year and the reason that makes me happy is because that means that I never had to use this you know, I am so happy that this expired. I don't ever want to have to use it. <coughs> you know, I'd love to go through a box a year and never, ever need them. So, um, it also makes me happy just because now I have ones that are good for another year. Because these, these expired in, in, like, in March. So, I don't know how effective they are at this point. Um, so, new, fresh one that I know, God forbid I ever need it, will work. And I'm just also glad that I have it, so put that in my purse, and um, I will put this probably in my suitcase to uh, just take back to Florida on the plane with me. For now, I'm just going to put this old one in here, since it is not expired yet, technically, to keep it for now. So, very happy uh, that I never had to use that, and hopefully I won't have to use these. And I'm going to go ahead and upload my vlog while I uh, eat the soup. Um, I can tell you about how the weather is outside by saying that I'm glad that I'm not on a horse right now. And it takes a lot for me to say that. Uh, it is just, oh guys, it is just nasty. I made a, I posted a comment on Facebook. I was like, if it doesn't stop raining soon, I'm literally going to need to build a boat. <laughs> um, I was taking Princess out to go to the bathroom and I would walk and it would just squish like water, not even mud, but straight water would squish up from underneath my tennis shoes. And it's just insane. We're supposed to get um, better tomorrow. We're supposed to be uh, uh, sunny about after one o'clock and almost 70 degrees. So looking forward to that if the forecast holds true. Um, and I still haven't heard back from my instructor yet, but hopefully I can set up a lesson for Wednesday. And uh, for tonight, I'm just going to eat the soup, probably get my treatment done after I eat the soup to get it out of the way early. And uh, just rest and watch Amazing Race and 
hang out and uh, weather out the storm. So with that, thank you guys so much for coming along on my day today, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night.